Hello, Kevin Neely here doing a review of these Godaken robots once again. Today we've got Bioman, Biojet 1 and 2, Bio Dragon. Uh, as you can see, both boxes here. It's actually just the box cover for Bioman. You can see a little bit of wear up top, corner edge wear. You know, uh, this robot shield's been repainted. The chrome was all. This all this chrome was showing white wear from being played with. The sword, as you can see, he's been repainted by me. Good Aiken swords are always chrome, no black handle. That's customized. I figured since I was redoing it, why not make it one of a kind? I have no plans to resell it, so I don't really care if it affects resale value. The piece is simply much nicer than it once was. One thing about this piece <coughs> that decreased its value, it had an eighth of an inch chip out of one of his yellow horns. You can't see it now. As you can see, it's been repaired by me. You can't even really tell by looking at it, which... Here, I'll zoom in. You can't tell. Which horn's been repaired. The way I did it, I thought about this for a while. I found an old yellow flashlight, similar color, canary yellow. If you look closely, you'll see a little triangular, isosceles triangular shape that's been cut out right around the groove section of that old flashlight which has now been fabricated, shaped, glued, and painted on. Oh, and I'll show you with my hand. I'm using my other hand where there's no shadow. Come in slowly. Right here is the repaired one. On, on the robot's left side, my right side. <clears throat> Alright, anyhow. I'm going to set Bio-Dragon, Bio-Man, excuse me, to the side. Give you a quick rundown of Bio Dragon. As you can see, the box is crushed right here, some. And it's got some typical box wear. I don't know, C6 perhaps, with that crushing. Where's the sneak picture? This is when you transform it into the flying vehicle, which I shall now do. down. This piece tilts down. See, it tilts down. Shuts. And actually, what I'm doing wrong here. This is flips up like this. And this panel actually doesn't shut, it flips over the top.
they're black, so it makes them tougher to see on this glass table. Anyhow, this folds up. It's in like this. It's the other side. that I was pushing that button earlier and flip that up. Okay, sorry. It's kind of tricky. These little wings flip up right here. This shut, there's a little button on, on the front of it you gotta push to get it to go in and lock in to pull the little side locking pegs in. Okay, so... That's the completes the transformation once you flip these five wings down on each side here. Okay. So that is Bio Dragon transformed. Okay. Here we have go take an insert. Nice condition. Fortunate this set actually came with three missiles. You may notice this red piece here. I'm not really sure. I found it inside a bio dragon. I'm not sure where it goes. I've been looking at at the inside of the bio dragon inside and out. Can't really figure out where it goes. But nevertheless, we got three missiles. Instruction booklet. I like this little tray that these missiles pop in. Very neat. This foam and everything's in real nice shape. So, after doing the repairs to Bioman, here, I'll show you the sword in his hand here. It's with the black hilt, with the white for the background where you can see it. Once again, dark background so you can see the contrast for the repaired horns. missile. I'm going to show you a couple missile launching features. This is, I don't know if anybody's ever actually seen. The only Bioman review I've ever seen was in either Japanese or Chinese. and uh, He didn't show this feature of the uh, Bio Dragon. If you can see the missile launches in there. And of course, I kept caught it cleanly. No, not exactly hit the table. You can hear that. Okay, anyway, take the same missile. As you can see, right here, it's right in the shoulder. Right there. Right in the shoulder of Biojet 1, which is a neat feature for the robot to have the shoulder missiles. Of course, later when you make the transformation of Biojet 1 and 2, um, I'll show you in the box right here. As you can see, Biojet 1 there on the right. If you look down under the wing, you can see the yellow missile. That's the top of the shoulder in transformation, obviously. some more room to quickly do a transformation of Bio Man. Yeah, remove the shield. How do you get up close look at the paint job that I did on that? And you know, with chrome paint, you're not going to get the same true chrome look that you will on a perfect new Godakin chrome sword out of a box, but it's the next best thing, in my opinion. One more look at the sword. Okay. There's a button on the back of Bio Man here, right there. There's this button allows for separation of the two two jets. We'll transform Bio Man, Bio Jet One first. 
Now the cool thing, I don't ever plan on selling this piece, but if I ever did and got hard up for money, and then wanted to make sure that that horn never got touched in transport, praying that the person that buys it doesn't let their kid take it out and play with it in the mud pit out in the backyard, God forbid if they did, I'd catch up with them and find them and take my white glove off and put a brick in it and give them the old Bugs Bunny cheek to cheek. <clears throat> As you can see, that fits over and will protect the horn completely in transport. Uh, you know, obviously in display mode it should be alright long after I'm gone. Um, you want to fire the, the fists off right here. And actually turn them 90 degrees. Okay. They're actually part of the transformation. This is a unique feature maybe people may not know about Biojet. If you'll look at the t the tops of the fifth, they're actually exhaust uh, turbine jet engines. See, put that in, put that in, right there. And as you can see, the fifths are part of the engines. Once again, great engineering by Godakin. Godakin and Poppy, you know, thinking ahead, ahead of the curve as always. Add another missile in. Landing gear pops out. And neat feature here. This flips up. The wheels flip out and around and back down again. You may not have been able to see that, but anyhow. Next piece. Turn it 90 degrees. Pull the, in the feet out. Twist them. Twist and spin, twist and spin. These wings come out right here. Wings come out here. Alright, here's a neat feature. These flip up. Flip up. Exposing the landing gear. Using my exacto blade. I'll pull it down. Flip these top things up. And there you have it. Biojet 1 and 2. Um, I would transform the uh, Bio Dragon back into a carrier and put the airplanes on top of it. There's a couple of little slots where each one locks into, or, the, or one on the back side anyway. There's nothing really else to show about this set. I'm running out of time here, so i got to limit this to sub-15 minutes. Um, you know, I can't find any other marks on this piece. You know, the horn repair went really well, the shield and the sword. You know, the boxes are good and so, you know, solid boxes. Good good foam insert on Bioman's box so uh, you know I'm real happy to add this piece to my collection and hope to enjoy it for many years to come anyway this concludes my uh, review of the uh, Godakin Bioman and Bio Dragon.